All right, everybody. I don't know if I'm going to use sound on this or not, but I wanted to show you the, the path that kind of the Kimmy walked. So we're on the other side of the cemetery here. This would be closer to uh, Pearl Street. And this is going to be uh, the, the location of where they found her at. Uh, this was a path here that was, that was used to cut through by the kids. Now clear on the other side of this cemetery is what's called Soul Street. And uh, Soul Street, they actually cut a hole in the fence up on Soul Street. So this path was what she was taking to her, uh, her friend's house where they were going to go buy uh, hair dye or something to that effect. So I'm going to be very careful not to walk over anyone's grave here. Uh, we're going to come up on a memorial here. Now the memorial was not the location of the discovery. You can see kids have just rode, ridden through this with bikes. Uh, she was she was discovered up in these up in this hill here. So here's the monument for Kimmy. Families left some stuff there, and as many people walk through this, you know this is a rough area. Nobody touches this. Uh, down over the hill here, we have uh, Crawford Village, some projects. A lot of good people there, but it's a rough neighborhood. Uh, I know it's January and 60 degrees right now, but I wanted to at least bring something. Uh, the store I stopped at didn't have any good flowers, but... So this is, again, the monument. And then some area up here, she was found by a Duquesne light worker which is our power company. So if you're gonna follow the power lines, you're kind of gonna see here where they go through. So basically where the power lines go through to Discovery would have been made up in there. We'll try to get up in there. And this is basically where one of her shoes were found. Uh, I don't, the, not the exact location, but in the area. Another shoe was found over here. Somewhere down in this area here. I'll get the exact location. Uh, I have a police officer that actually wrote the report. Help me. But somewhere down in there. So this is a cut through. So if you look all the way clear at the other side of the cemetery, it's Soul Street. And there's, you kind of walk down the road. If you, if you didn't cut through here, you'd have to walk up to Versailles Avenue. It'd probably take you another 10 minutes to do it. Uh, We'll just walk down the rest of this way, and I'll show you here. This is Pearl Street. This is a street we try not to bring the fire trucks down because of the situation with the street. So there you could see where they where you would come out at if you walk. This is part one of a video series on the death of Kimberly Krim. I have about 20 more minutes of additional video, and I plan to shoot some more as I'll be releasing it over the coming days and weeks. If anyone knows anything, you can email me at kevlar148 at hotmail.com. And if you don't want to talk to the police, I will keep it anonymous.